worth it by Mark. Hello, it's Mark from Worth It Repairs by Mark, and today we're doing an iPhone 14 screen replacement. Need your splicer? Got to get a spudger, a wide triple zero screwdriver, and your P2 star bit for the bottom. All right. First, we're going to take off out the P2 screws, and then we're going to heat up the screen in our heater. It is not on the video. I'm sorry about that. But once you heat up the screen, then we'll show you how to pry it off. If it's too hot to touch, then it's hot enough, and it's time to pry out the screen. I already heated it up uh, outside the camera view. Anyways, um, it's a, I use a... Um, crock pot actually filled with silicone pads and that heats it up for me. But you want to start at the bottom of the screen just like any other iPhone. This is my first look into the iPhone 14 so I was quite surprised what I found on the inside. I hope you enjoy the repair. Uh, this is my first time doing it so I'm learning more about it and it looks like it's going to be a pretty great phone to repair in the future. Voila! Here is the iPhone 14 inside of it. What the heck? There's this metal plate here. I don't know what's going on. Where the heck is the battery connection? I figured it out. I had to go off camera and look it up a little bit, and it looked like it might be on the back. And I was uh, just... I didn't want to mess anything up, so I made sure I actually turned it off before I ran off the screen. Now... Let's bust out that wide triple zero screwdriver, unscrew the screen's connection here, and then the proximity sensor as well. And you can't pry it with your fingers here. Uh, little brackets are getting away from me. I trimmed my nails a little bit too early in the week this week. Makes my job a lot harder. Anyways, at least we have spudgers. So I got my spudger out, and then I was able to get these connections off here. I was extremely worried I might have broken it because I didn't disconnect the battery. But I went ahead with the repair. So I'm just testing the screen to make sure it boots up still. It's still booting up after I turn it off. So I'm just going to turn it off again here. And then oh, let's move on with the repair. Get that plastic sponger out. Disconnect that. Got to get the proximity sensor off here. Why? Triple zero screwdriver. There's two screws on there. It's really hard to get off. Actually recommend using heat. Or maybe even acetone for it, but uh, there is, I use heat and then like slowly kind of pry at it underneath with metal pry tool. Or sometimes I try to use a plastic tool, but they're just not as thin as I would like them to be. But um, there is, so I just carefully kind of like pull on it here and just watch the video here and you'll see how I got it off. So I, um, I'm working my way around the proximity sensor here, and I'm just getting all the proximity light sensor uh, moved out with some tweezers, and maybe loosen up the end a little bit so I can get a better pull on it. There we go. I was able to get it off. Now i got to put it on the new screen and just lay it all back just how I saw it. And then we get to test the phone. Well, we'll lay down the adhesive and then test the phone, and then... Put it all the way together and call it good. There we go. I've been 14. Screw replace it. Worth it! Like and subscribe. While I put this together, I would like to uh, answer some questions you guys might have for me, like how I can turn it off. Uh, so if you can't turn it off, you'll disconnect the battery. You would have to take off the back first and then disconnect the battery and then disconnect the screen. Um, if you can't or whatever, you can always try like a force reboot, force reboot it, uh, use, do the key sequence, volume up, volume down, click and hold volume inside, and then it should turn off and then turn back on. Force restart, it could turn it back on too. 
And then also, um, if Face ID didn't work anymore. So Face ID did work after I did the screen replacement. I'm not quite sure if you break the proximity sensor, if the Face ID will go away anymore. I don't know the answer to that yet. But please, leave me a comment below. I'll try to help you the best I can. Thanks. Like and subscribe.